All right, we're doing our last supercharger stop before we get to Ben's car. And along Interstate 80, most of the superchargers are at high V. I personally think this is, um, they've really kind of hit the nail on the head as far as quality charging stations and, and amenities. So here they, they put the stations in the back of the lot so it's unlikely that you're going to get a combustion car parking back here. And then what's really neat about the hy in addition to being a grocery store um, where you can pretty much get anything you want, pharmacy, they also have a Starbucks. Now I'm a big coffee fan so I need my coffee. I got some at the last one so I won't be getting here. But the other real thing that I really like is their market grill. So it's a little area where you can sit down, tables, um, you can bring a laptop in. They have lots of charging ports for your laptops as well. And they have a prepared food section. So you can get everything from sushi to a chicken dinner to Chinese or whatever, and just take it in there. And they have table service if you want it. If you don't, you can get food from there. And I really think that's a great way to handle it. At this particular stop, we're looking at about a half hour stop. So, you know, we might, it's about lunchtime, we might get a snack here. So I really think they've done a nice job here. And this is an example, in my opinion, of how other charging stations should be located. Check out Carl's blog and his podcast. Links are in the video description. And as always, we'd love it if you followed our adventures right here on this YouTube channel and at 300mpg.org. Until next time, stay charged up.